In this video, we will learn how to take backup of WordPress website. Taking WordPress backup regularly is one of the primary jobs for website owners. During this video, we will learn how to backup your WordPress website and how to make a schedule of auto backup. And also how to restore your website from that backup file. So stay tuned with this video. First, we need to install a plugin. The name is WP Vivid. Install and activate that. After activating it will automatically redirect you to this WP Vivid page. Or you can click on Backup and Restore to see this page. Now you can take a backup of your website. But before that, let me introduce some settings of the plugin. In general setting, you can set the total number of saved backup files. Like, the last seven backup files will be saved, and the older ones will be deleted automatically. Now save changes. Then go to advanced settings. Increase the PHP execution timeout for backup. Also, increase the PHP memory limit for backup. These two things will make taking backups easy for large websites. Do the same for the restore part. So, we are ready to take a backup of our website. If we take a backup, then it will be saved in our hosting storage. But you can connect your online storage with your website so that each time you take a backup that backup file will be uploaded to your Google Drive or Dropbox automatically. This is much more secure. Just select your desired cloud storage. and click on Authentication. Choose an account, and authenticate. Make a name. And add now. After it is successfully added, it will appear here. Now you should schedule the backup runtime. Like, daily, weekly, or monthly. Then select the storage. This time I want to save the backup files to Google Drive. Save changes. Let's take a manual backup. I am selecting remote storage for this backup. Click backup now. Backup is done. You can see the backup file here. You can check the backup date here. You can view the file size here. Also, you can download the backup file from the connected Google Drive.
This time we will show you how to restore your website from the backup file. Let's make some changes to our theme. Look, it's a broken site. Now we will restore this. You can download the backup file and upload it here. Also, there is a different method of uploading the backup file directly. Just click on Retrieve the backup to localhost. Then the process will be started slowly. After uploading the backup file manually, you will see that in this list. Also, you will see this if you take backup in your hosting server directly. This sign indicates that the file is in your hosting server now. Which means you can restore your backup file directly. Just proceed to restore. Restore completed. Let's check our site now. It looks like our site is fine now. The restoration is successful. So, this is the video on how to take backup of WordPress website. If you face any issues while trying this by yourself, then feel free to ask me in the comment section. If you liked this video then hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.